Hi everybody, I'm coming to you with my latest project. This is a project I was working on in the middle of the night one evening. And this is based on a video that I saw on YouTube by Liz Merrick. And she has a cake company called Artisan Cake Company. And I think if you type in Artisan Cake Company, her videos will pop up. She makes the most amazing, amazing videos and has the most amazing tutorials. And so she did a pregnant cake topper, pregnant lady cake topper uh, video. And I thought it was just to die for. And so I wanted to attempt that. So this is dedicated to you, Liz. And typically people do the sausage arms and the sausage legs and their figurines. And that's fine because that's how I did mine. But it's refreshing to be able to see and learn how to do a cake topper where the figure looks more realistic. And Liz shows you how to do that. So this young lady uh, probably has a more of a sophisticated twist to her. I gave her a beret, a necklace, a shawl, and a purse. She's wearing a pink outfit and her skirt has green polka dots in it. And um, her hair is just ordinary. I didn't try to straighten it or curl it or anything like that. Um, it was late and uh, so I wasn't, you know, didn't make it so detailed. But her smile is as big as New York City. <laughs> so, so that's one of the things I need to work on. And her chin is a little bit too wide. So, um, and if I had some gum paste and fondant that cooperated, um, things would be a little bit different I think. I think the end result would be much better. She's got some cracking in her chest area and my camera doesn't focus so um, you can't really see it too well. Her nose is fine. She kind of has an angry look but the smile kind of takes a little bit of that away. Um, but overall I'm pleased with um, this is the first realistic looking cake topper that I've ever done or figurine that I've ever done. So. I'm pretty pleased with it. I give myself an A for effort and a B for execution. <laughs> um, she is um, just as cute as she can be and her legs are super long. This is a six inch cake pan. It's three inches deep and her legs pretty much hit the bottom of the pan. So if she stood up, she'd be about six foot three. <laughs> So, um, anyways, I plan to do more, and Liz, I hope you do a guide to go with the pregnant lady. Um, I'm sure the steps are pretty much the same, only the guy's going to be a little bit bulkier, but the face is probably where I would really need the help, and other people will too. So, thank you for posting your wonderful videos. They're awesome. I hope you continue to make more, and um, this is dedicated to you, and, and thank you so much, and I hope you guys enjoy. Take care. Bye-bye.